Starbucks is literally so bougie, it doesn't have any prices on it. I'm too far for this. Hello everybody, welcome back to my channel. Welcome back to another vlog. I thought I wasn't gonna see you until the new year, but I was wrong. I'm a little embarrassed because my room looks like a tornado. A tornado for Is that even how the song goes? Anyway, um, it's really messy. It's really bad. I just filmed a haul video and a try on video and the room is even worse. So like, let me just show you. So like, that's the bed situation. That's the floor situation. This situation ain't looking cute either. And I'm filming on my iPhone 13. I wanted to see how well it vlogs, but I feel like it's really close. So I'm like literally holding it so far away from my face. So hopefully um, today's vlog is okay. Before I get started, I do want to thank today's sponsor. You know, my faves is Light Lashes. I will tell you more about them later. We do have a very special sneak peek. I'm going to tell you about their Boxing Day sale, which obviously hasn't been released yet, but I'm going to tell you about it. I got that insider info, you know what I mean? So I'm going to tell you about that later, but first I think we need to clean the house um, and I'm going to catch you up on my life because I have been through it. I have been constantly going through it and I have been doing a few things things that I want to include in the vlog. Girl, are you okay? While I clean, let me tell you guys a few things that I did that I want to share with you. I went to the Christmas market this year with my best friend. Uh, we double dated. Can we see how angry the waves are today? Where is the windmill? Where is the windmill? Oh, she going off. It's windy today. Holy shit. Look at that shit. Ooh. Surfing. Oh, it's big. <laughs> Diane, Avenger, and Pinata. Spicy? Not spicy. Not spicy? Oh boy. No, it's really good though. Mm. Hot. The next morning after the Christmas market, my best friend had to work. So we just went downtown with her fiance, um, which is also another one of our really good friends. And he took us to dim sum in Chinatown. It's kind of cold out today. Okay. We're gonna go out for dim sum. little bit I have spent a little bit of money um, I've been really digging into all of the good sales around here you know what I mean I can't say no to a good sale um, so I have to find places for all of these clothes I now have and I also have to get rid of a lot of the clothes that I no longer wish to keep. Something that I've been really trying to adapt into my life now is to let go of clothes that don't fit me anymore and I just want to have a better relationship with my body. Um, I feel like I am holding on to who I was when I was in high school. A lot of these clothes back from when I was in high school and like first year university when I was under a hundred pounds. And maybe for like 17, 18 years old, that's fine. But like, maybe I've gained a little bit of weight. I feel like for what I am right now as a 26 year old woman, 110 pounds is not like crazy heavy. But I think um, in my mind, I, want to be like I keep thinking like oh I need to get back down to a zero zero I need to get back down to like an extra extra small I'm just trying to learn to love myself and my body and um, learn to love the changes that adulthood and womanhood um, oop, 
like offer your body you know like obviously my hips are gonna get wider obviously my skin is gonna get softer and more supple because my body is preparing to bear children one day if that is my wish and I need to be okay with that I am going to the gym constantly and I'm trying to build a fat ass so like obviously my ass isn't, doesn't fit into like zero zeros anymore and that's okay it's okay that I don't fit into a double zero anymore and I have to get a size two like it's so stupid when I say it out loud and like say it out like that because it just is really stupid and I'm sorry. <laughs> this whole haul of clothes, I finally got really nice clothes that fit my body that I feel comfortable in and I am just happy to like finally get rid of all the stuff in my closet that I feel like doesn't serve me a good purpose anymore except for like weigh me down and make me feel like I need to lose weight. I. <laughs> I'm not entirely sure what the purpose of this conversation was. I just wanted to like talk, let you guys know where I was at with my body, even though it's really nobody's business about my body. Upon reviewing the footage, I don't know whether or not I like it. My phone is doing this like HDR thing where it's like looking a little too crisp and a, a little too, a little too much for what I want in a vlog. So. Hopefully this vlog doesn't look ratchet. So I'm just sitting at my computer now because I have a video that will already have been uploaded once you see this vlog. I'm working a little hard today, trying to finish the YouTube game strong this year. Yeah, I've been having a really good time just um, being free with my content. So thank you guys for kind of going through this journey with me as I figure out what I wanna do on the internet and what I wanna share and what I don't wanna share. So this weekend, my family and I are celebrating our Christmas. Now I know that there's been talks of Omicron and not meeting up and everything, but like I am triple vaxxed. I don't know if I ever mentioned that. I did vlog it, but I don't know if I ever put it. Oh, you know what? Actually, I'm pretty sure that my, my fiance took me to my appointment and I'm pretty sure he vlogged me on my ass the next day so i'm gonna put in that video footage of me after my third dose hey everyone this is diane unfortunately she's feeling the symptoms of her third shot she's feeling the symptoms of cold it's hot really hot right now she's hot but really she's cold. wrapped in a blanket no i'm really cold right now i was she's really hot cold hot she's just going through it i'm really dizzy oh but everyone should what <laughs> Everyone get vaccinated, yep. even though this isn't really like a good picture. Most of my immediate family is triple vaxxed already. So I'm only going to be seeing like literally my immediate family this weekend. So I am going to go and make stuffing because Connor's dad has a really mean recipe for stuffing. Like it's so good. So I'm going to make it tonight so I can bring it over and I'll make it with you guys. And I have never made this kind of stuffing before. So hopefully it turns out good. Otherwise, I'm afraid I might have just poisoned my whole family. But anyway, before I go off and make the stuffing, I did just want to sit down real quick and tell you guys I'm really excited about this sponsor if you guys haven't already heard me talk about them before or see me wear them all the time um i'm talking about life lashes i want to show you guys a new bold collection that they have i have all of them right here i am going to put pictures on the screen as i talk about them but i've been obsessed with their lashes since the first time they reached out to me which was it feels like years ago now and they just released a new bold collection i've never gotten anything from life lashes that i don't wholeheartedly love, which is why I always am honored to do a sponsorship and a collab with them. They told me that I was allowed to share this with you actually. They have a Boxing Day sale coming up, obviously on Boxing Day, and it's 50% off the whole site, which I know I just received these, but I will be stocking up. Like their lash glue is elite. Their lashes are elite. It's just, they change the game. The one thing that I really love the most about these is that they look super natural. And the, the thing about the bold lashes is that they are still natural. I am wearing B1 right now, which is the tapered and wing style. If you feel like you really want to try them out, Boxing Day, the 50% off sale is coming your way. Now the different thing about the bold collection in comparison to the original one is that obviously these are just more bold which honestly, I'm a diva. I'm a little bit about that life. <laughs> I like to be a little bit more extra, so I love the Bold Collection. It makes me feel good to use these because on top of everything, on top of how amazing they are, they are also 100% vegan and cruelty-free. They're made with like 
really high quality synthetic 100% so they are not testing on animals they are similar to like mink lashes um, I find that the look of them they're just like so luxurious and so amazing anyway there's six styles in the bulk collection um, B1 I'm gonna put all the styles on the screen here so we can save some time B1 is tapered and wing which is what I'm wearing right now I really love this one like I'm in love with it B2 is full flare for the little extra baddie out there. We love to see her. B3 is kabuki, another really solid choice. B4 is wispy and bold, which is another one of my favorites. B5 is five and fluttery, which I really love for a delicate feminine, but like that extra oomph kind of look, which is like, anyway, <laughs> all these lashes do it for me. It just depends on how I'm feeling. And the last one is B6, prim and pleated. And I'm so honored to be talking about them and having the sponsorship. So thank you guys so much for giving me this opportunity. I really do hope that you go check them out if you are curious, if you're looking for a really nice luxury lashes. Did I say that right? Luxury lashes. If you have an opportunity, Boxing Day, 50% off. Make sure you go there before stock runs out. I guarantee you won't be disappointed. not a color I would buy for myself, but I, know that, I could see it like being nice. nice. Yeah. Is it bigger? I think it, it is. It is bigger. It really is <laughs> bigger. I used to be able to pick it up with just one hand and spray it, but this is like a two hand situation here. Starbucks is literally so bougie. It doesn't have any prices on it. We are currently in the drive through line right now for some Starbucks because we are on our way to celebrate um, Christmas with Connor's family today. Our bigger Christmas parties for next week, like actual Christmas time got canceled and I'm really upset about it. So I'm just trying to make the most out of Christmas this week. We had ours with my family yesterday, which you guys would have seen already. And then we're just gonna have another small one with Connor's family. And uh, it's quite the drive away. So we need some coffee and some sustenance. An iced venti uh, matcha. Oh, venti. Yeah, uh, and then can I have that? Get a um, Thank you. Yeah, for sure. Thanks. Have a nice day. Have a good day. Bye. Thank you. You too. This little gnome guy fell, but when we get to the house, I'm gonna show you guys this cute cake that we got for Christmas. Well, Connor's mom ordered it, so I wanted to give a shout out to my girl Melinda. Her information is here. If you guys are in the GTA, more specifically Brampton area, and you guys want a bomb ass cake, she made us a really, really nice cake for our engagement party, and it was the best cake in the whole world. Connor is obsessed with it. So she does like a lot of cake decorations and she does like cake pops and stuff like that. So if you guys are interested, check her out. Highly recommend Dream Treats by Melinda. I am very fully aware that I look busted right now. I'm like oily, took my lashes off, got a little bit of lip crust from the lip red lipstick is fine. 
um this is where i'm going to end the vlog so thank you guys so much for watching and for tuning in keeping up with my life thank you again to life lashes for sponsoring today's video and don't forget about the boxing day sale that's coming up honestly the best time to get these lashes if you've ever been curious um and i will see you guys in my next video i hope you guys have a wonderful holiday and uh happy new year and i'll see you in the new year for real this time <laughs> okay bye